Napoleon's hat. What's, Small fellow. What's with the upturned V? I don't know. This way up? It was a favourite of Voltaire, Marie Antoinette and a raft of French revolutionaries. How is it? Oh, that's lovely. Good. In a moment of weakness, we order calf's head casserole, the signature dish of this 17th century chop house. But before we cow down, Mel demands we plough through a plate of invertebrates. Oh, crumbs. Here we go. Mr Forky goes right deep oh, hello. into snail town. Well, the colour of this is something I need to ignore. It's really nice. And I'm good for snail. Did you like that? I'm good for it. I really like that. Really? Yeah. Absolutely. What's amazing to me is it tastes like snail. It, it tastes quite gardeny, doesn't it? I still not it? got through it. I'm still resisting. As Rod Stewart yeah. sang, I am mm. snailing. Mm. Snail away, snail away, snail away. As then you would say. With mathematical inevitability, the second course follows the first, and we buckle up for bovine bonds. Here we go. <sighs> Ready? Calf's head. That's very French. That's really good. See if I can clear the decks with a bit of carrot. <laughs> wow. Really sorry. I don't know if that's champers. I don't know whether that's brain stems. I'm really sorry. No. It's charming. It's awful. No. I'm so sorry. It's very continental. Let me top you up with sparkling water. I think it's a sign of. It's a sign it, of good times. Enjoy it. Here we come. <laughs> that was a deep one. That was from the shoes. Sorry. It's I'm really you feel, unattractive. I'm no, sorry. It's because it's you're awful. relaxed. Yeah. You're relaxed. I think you've been holding this in for years. It's the champs, mate, honestly. Mm, mm. Have you mm -hmm. eaten some stem? I don't know. The texture altered during that bite. And that Did it become is a draw. Maybe time to say tutty bye-byes. Yeah. Yeah, we're going to skip. 5 p.m. is the Parisian precursor to wine time, and in the 19th century was known as the Green Hour, in reference to the populace's penchant for absinthe. Also known as the Green Fairy, it is distilled from a mix of fennel, aniseed, and wormwood shrub. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, lovely. Now, so, what's yeah. the sugar cube? And have to do like that. Drop and drop. Okay. And when the sugar is dissolved, Sweet. yes. Dissolved, yes. You can drink. Shall I? I shall I yes. open up my hose? Okay. Yeah. Get oh, your full set. Whoa. Too much. <laughs> Sorry. Too much. Sorry. It can be as strong as 89% alcohol, and after being blamed for a variety of ills, from a rise in alcoholism to tuberculosis and even murder. Wow. Absinthe was banned in 1914 for almost a century. Yeah, I mean, it's like very strong Dental. toothpaste. Dental. Oh, did you feel that at the back of your brain? Head? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, Just it's... Just had a slight... Had a slight... I mean, I'm certainly not going to chug my way through this. My eyes have locked. Well... Slightly locked eyes. Yeah, already. No, no there is a glaze. It's a slight glaze. There's a glaze. I've got the absinthe glaze. Yeah, I'm, I'm not so sure. How are you feeling? I feel tired. Depressed. Yes. Melancholy. You're spiralling through a Rolodex of emotions there. Slightly melancholy. People will ferment anything, won't they? They will. Bricks, bits of tears, anything. <laughs> oh, wow. You're really leaning into that punch. I well, think you have to bra brace into it. Okay. Bonjour à tous. Bonjour, chef. Bonjour. Bonjour. Welcome to Le Cordon Bleu Paris. Thank you. You know why you're here today? Definitely. Yes. We're going to really. make macarons. That's and right. Make them really good. I can see how this is going. <laughs> you immediately teach us pet. You're I'm right there. I'm right You're close. at the apex. I don't I'm like what's happening. Already the favourite. Chef Olivier Mahou begins the class by mixing together ground almonds and sugar. This has been pre-weighed. Yeah, yeah, that's pre-weighed. Okay. So thus far, I haven't made a mistake. And then deftly segues to whisking the eggs. It's actually quite tiring, isn't it? It's this knuckle, isn't it? Mary Berry. I know. With the whisking. That's why she's so sinewy. She's all sinew. I know. Sinew. She's like a young Iggy Pop. Let's hope she doesn't start taking her top off like Iggy. Now, Paul Hollywood, is that his real name? Yes. 
you're out of your mind, that's his real name. Next, Chef shows us how to gently combine the two mixtures. It's like if you're doing the breast, uh, the stroke. Or breast stroke. Yeah, breast stroke. Breast yeah. Stroke. Okay, yeah. all right. So one hand does going this. for a forest. Kate Bush. Yeah, that's it. That too. That works. Yeah. Okay. Early so Kate one Bush. hand does this. Yeah. Okay. And the other one does oh, this. Oh, nice. Okay. So it's like doing this. Oh, great. Right. Displaying the kind of empathy and bonhomie for which I am famed, I proceed to find out about our fellow chefs. Have you made macaroon? Never. Have you made macaroon? Have you made macaroon? Yeah. This guy. Yeah, we are <laughs> you bake all the time, right? Sometimes. Yes. Sometimes. Oh, Come on. I see. Only when he's not managing his international business. Anyone wearing a pink shirt, I trust. You trust? I trust. Because it's, it's a choice. It doesn't just happen to you. Yeah. So you're thinking about life. We add natural food colouring and prepare the mixture to pipe onto the baking tray. Ow. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Chef. I need support. No problem, no problem. I'm here, I'm here. Look, look, okay. look, look. Here we go. Okay. Isn't that What's cheating? Happening? Isn't that slightly cheating? No. That the chef okay. has actually taken so you your see? bag? I'm trying to learn. <laughs> C'est bon. You get to the end of your life, what do you say? Yes. I've won. He's no. just done that for you. You say I've lived. <laughs> I've connected. I've got very unsteady hands because of anxiety. After three hours as a pastry chef, I feel I might finally be able to hold my own in my fortnightly Greg's discussion group. That's a good macaroon. That's good, huh? That's a good yeah. macaroon. Just when I think we won't receive certificates, we receive certificates, and my rage subsides to be replaced by a sense of utter achievement. Thank you very much. Thank you. Well done, Richard. Thank you. I feel that would have happened regardless of what happened here. Merci, chef. Merci beaucoup. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Everyone, look, got yeah. the... That's Certi look, it's a certificate of attendance. It just means it isn't. you came. It isn't.